The entire Miami community has been shell-shocked by the tragic Surfside condo collapse. Please visit supportsurfside.org to find out how you can make your contribution. Back to him. It's Janos Lubin with numbers in the box. Lubin's cross, friend Swan up there. Ultimately cleared off the line by Miller. Pope has trouble with it. De Silva can't bring it under his spell. Even if it is the keeper. It's Pierre De Silva! Oh. What a strike! Outstanding! In the end, we'll see. Here's another look. I beg your pardon, you're right. Chapman Page is gonna be the one to get credit for this one. Now you have to move past this and keep on playing the game. You have to continue to be aggressive. Dane Kelly could be in behind. It's Dane Kelly and it's flicked away by Sparrow. You can't blink for more than a second with that man's perspective. Yeah, Miami catches a break defensively this time. Chapman Page unable to clear the ball away. Opportunity. Well done by Pope, look at that. Winning the ball back with options to his left. Pope to Kelly, Dane Kelly, and it squeaks through. Inside the six and the finish from Kelly. You know, it's a challenge, but it's an honor as well to have a team selected to the national team. Dane Kelly is tripped in the box, and JC Griggs points to the spot. Kelly has gone down, and Charlotte pick up their league-leading seventh penalty of the season. Have six PKs this year. Kelly, who, that's not on the first one, it's right there. Dane Kelly scoots it wide, and Miami breathe life into this game. Trying to make something of this, he's double teamed. Given away right back to Othello Ba. Ba slips in, Martinez! Who knows what to do with that? Finding Ariel Martinez with the finish. And what a goal it is for Miami FC this time. Given away again, Sabella. Valentin Sabella has it on his left, fires, and Sparrow is there to save the game. Have yearned for something positive. They get that positive result tonight. All three points and a win for Miami for the second time this season against Charlotte.